so I convinced my brother and my other brother from another mother, hey, let's go walk to San Jose Island. Our trip getting there had had its little trials and tribulations. A little rough getting across the Ransas Bay. We even ran aground getting there. Brian had to get out and push us. Thank you, Brian. Driving at Cedar Bayou, though, changes all the time, every day. Tides bring in new sand, pull, new, pull the old sand out. There it is, what a is south. They opened this up a few years back and it, it feeds the bays with fresh, fresher water and nutrients. That's in the place. Beautiful in its own way. Let's get this trip going. So the journey begins. 21 miles, three men in their 50s, carrying 25 pound packs on their back on a beach that most people don't get to see. Right in our backyard, unclean, unpolished. This is a boat we visited 10 years ago on the same beach on the north end of San Jose. As you can see today, it's dissolving into the sand like we all do. It's so true when they say rest never sleeps. Remnants of other shipwrecks all over. Strange items you don't see on a regular beach. Nobody, nobody for miles and miles. The peace and tranquility of it all is amazing. With danger lurking everywhere. Man must be careful. We made it halfway, set up camp, right in the middle, 10 miles down, 10 miles to go. Brutal environment. Yeah, it's about uh, 10.30 at night, I'm laying here in the tent, uh, it's been raining on us, sprinkling, light drizzle for two or three hours, everything's wet. Oh, uh, but I still wouldn't trade this for nothing. You can see the mist floating around in the tent right now in the light. So uh, we'll see what happens. Still having a good time. Yeah, see y'all tomorrow. Well, good morning. Shit, that was a long night last night. Rained all night, cold as hell. Tarp didn't work well, but I made it. It's time to get the hell up. It's time to get the hell up. Ugh. Oh, yeah. Here's the guys over there. Foggy ass morning. It's a foggy morning. I've got coffee. That's all I need for breakfast. Coffee and a fire on a beach. Don't get no better. Oh, man. It was also time to make the load lighter. The load was too heavy. Plus all sleeping bags and everything got wet from over the night. 
So we're gonna burn it and move on down the beach. Man can lose his thought walking, walking that far. Wonder what happened with this story. Fucking way, dude. Oh, Brother, stop! Hey, stop! We found some strange grass clippings that people had cut along and stored it. Wait, no good. Trash. Whatever it was, it stunk. So we buried it. We found a total of eight boats on that trip. And other things unexpected. Holy shit! What the hell? Dunes turns up strange things. Things that's been laying there for hundreds, if not thousands, of years. What the fuck is this? Check out this shit, dude. The freaking skull, man. What the hell? Take a picture, leave it at that. Oh my god. What do you think that is? Indian? What do we do? What do we do? What do we do? Turns out it was just a piece of plastic. It's time to move on, finish his trip. I can hear that couch calling me. I can hear that couch calling my name. Let's get home. July 26, 1845, Lieutenant Chandler of USS Alabama weighed ashore and planted the first American flag to fly over Texas territory on a sand dune on the San Jose Island. Units of the 3rd Infantry established a small military town known as Aransas. The Stoge Cage Service brought passengers, goods, and mail to the town, and a ferry connected the island with the mainland. During the American Civil War, the Union Army removed livestock from the island and assaulted the town of Aransas of which no obvious trace today remains. After the war, the island's sole town ceased to exist and it became an exclusive hunting and fishing resort. It's all good. We moving on down that beach. Still finding stuff. Nets. All kind of plastic stuff. I must have found 20, 25 propane tanks that old golf shippers throwing off them boats. The whole pile of starfish. One unloaded. 
lucky survivor. Oh yeah. That is a beautiful sight, people. We made it all the way to the jetties. We made it, jetties. Brian, you pretty happy, Jeff? Yeah, where's Jeff now?